So I just want to show one way to bone out a pork butt. I like to locate the blade bone on the flat side and then turn it. You'll find a round shaped bone at the end of the blade bone. I start at the top of that round bone with the tip of my knife until I feel that blade bone. And I just use the tip of my knife, scrape along that bone. And then with your other hand, you're going to peel back and just keep following that bone. Just scraping off that bone until you get past it. <clears throat> and you'll feel where that bone ends, right back here. Then I fold the pork butt over and open it up so that my blade bone's sitting right on top facing me. Then you can see easily how to trace around with the tip of your knife that blade bone. Again, just using the tip of your knife, score along that blade bone. And as you go, you're putting pressure down to continually open up that cut you're making. And then you're going to turn your knife kind of flat and go along the inside of that blade bone. And with the tip of your knife, you'll hit a ridge bone. And once you get to that, you're going to stop, come up to the other side of your blade bone right on top, and cut right at the edge of your bone. Again, until you just till you're past the bone. Then your knife turns flat again, and you go up, and you're going to cut, cut around this bone at the end, and you're going to meet that ridge bone. So that both sides of this bone, the meat is free on both sides of it, so you can get your hand all the way into that ridge bone. Then all you're going to do is fold it. You can turn your knife, and you're just going to push the meat away, pull the bone down. So you're pushing with one hand, pulling with the other. You're going to come around that ridge bone. Just with the tip of your knife. And once you get around the top of that ridge bone, so you're going to come around on the top of that ridge bone. Once you get there, you just come down and connect with that cut you made on the other side. And then you can just pull your bone free. Decent way to get the bone out of there pretty quick. You can clean up anything that's left on there afterwards. But that leaves you a whole boneless pork butt. No big cuts, no flopping pieces. And you can just take it all apart at one time instead of just hacking apart bits and pieces.